For over 90 years, the American Red Cross of Nassau County has been helping those in need, but now they're asking for the public's assistance. You may have seen the American Red Cross of Nassau County assisting neighbors or helping other residents who've experienced a disaster in their lives. Typically, most of our disasters are house fires, and what we'll do is we'll provide temporary shelter for the residents of that house. We'll give them money for food, clothing, uh, medicines if they need it, uh, diapers for, for babies, et cetera. Give them a few days relief as they try to pick up the pieces. But Kelly says over the years, they've seen a significant increase in the number of people who need their help. And because of that, they've exceeded their budgeted funds for local disaster relief. Now, even though we've exceeded our budget, it's not going to mean that we're going to not give out as much a, as we do. Our, our mission is not going to change, but it's going to be a concern as we get later in the year. Now, the 2008 fiscal year began for the American Red Cross back in July and is a little more than half over. But officials say so far they've responded to more local emergencies than they did throughout the previous year. Kelly says because they're not a government agency or funded by taxpayer dollars, they need donations so they can continue to help those in need. In Mineola, Tom Allen, TV10 and 55 News. And for more information on how to contribute to the Red Cross of Nassau, you can log on to www.nassauredcross.org.